Hello everyone, my name is Jeff Fields McCormick and welcome back to Madden Mobile. Now as you can see on your screen, we do have a couple of new legends that just dropped. These guys dropped about an hour ago. We're going to jump right into their stats. Alright, so first off is one of my favorite players. I've got one of his autographs. He's always a class act and a ton of fun. He's a very nice guy, very loving guy. A great Hall of Famer, Seahawks legend. Number 71, Walter Jones. All right, so Walter Jones is a 91 overall offensive tackle with guaranteed 40 power when you claim him. He is for the verticals game plan, so if you run verticals, you will get a bonus for this player on your team. Walter Jones is the legendary number 71 for the Seattle Seahawks. All right, let's flip him over and take a look at those stats. Walter Jones is a pass protecting offensive tackle, so if you need help holding up your pocket long enough for your quarterback to throw, if you're having issues with a lot of defensive end defensive tackle linebacker pressure on the quarterback this is going to be the perfect card to keep your quarterback safe long enough to make the long passes the short passes whatever else needed to let you win games all right walter jones has 66 speed which is pretty low but you also have to keep in mind offensive tackles usually don't have high speed stats just like most other offensive linemen they're very powerful they're very strong the great blockers Speed doesn't really matter a whole lot for these guys. He does have, wow, 90 strength. This guy is incredibly strong. He has 76 agility, 76 acceleration. Those are a little low, but once again, those are speed-related stats. And on an offensive lineman, you're not going to see a whole lot of increased speed. This is due largely to the fact that offensive linemen don't run a whole lot. They go up, make the block, get a D lineman on the ground, block up a linebacker, block over possibly to a safety that's blitzing, but they're not going to be doing a whole lot of run oriented plays. So you're not going to see incredibly fast speed and associated stats like agility and acceleration on an offensive lineman like Walter Jones. He also has 92 awareness, which is really good. This means he's able to read what defenses are trying to do. He'll know exactly where the defensive tackles, defensive ends, the linebackers, all these players are coming from, a gap they're going to try to shoot, where they're going to try and go to get to the quarterback to get in the backfield, and he's able to make the appropriate blocks to whatever gap it may be to keep pressure off of your quarterback and off of your running back. As you'd expect, having a high awareness offensive lineman is incredibly important for this, and this will make it a lot easier for that player to make the appropriate blocks to keep your backfield players safe. So he has 87 run block, which is pretty high. That's a pretty good stat. 93 pass block is amazing. This means he's gonna be able to make the reads that he's gonna need. He's gonna be able to block up those defensive ends and defensive tackles. He's gonna be able to keep the quarterback safe long enough for the quarterback to get those passes off that are required for you to win a game. He also has 87 impact blocks. So he'll be putting guys on the ground left and right. With 87 impact block, you're gonna see a lot of pancakes with this player which ties back into his 90 strength, 92 awareness. This guy is a hard hitting offensive lineman. In real life, he was an absolute legend. He was one of the hardest hitting offensive linemen that I remember. And he will definitely be a great addition to your O-line. And finally, he has 88 pass block footwork. So a 93 pass block, 88 pass block footwork, he can make the reads and make the blocks needed to keep your quarterback safe. He also has the ability to shift around and march up the field to keep those defensive linemen and linebackers away from your quarterback. Walter Jones played in the NFL for 12 seasons and was selected all pro four times. Jones was selected to the Hall of Fame in 2014. Like I said, it's really cool getting to see Walter Jones in Mad Mobile. I won't be getting him right now because I already have two really good offensive linemen. I have the limited edition Joe Thomas, and then I also have Aaron Donald. As much as I like Walter Jones, and as cool as it is to see him, I personally won't be getting him. But if you need an offensive tackle on your team, especially a pass-oriented offensive tackle, then Walter Jones is the perfect addition to your Madden Mobile offense. This guy is a beast when it comes to blocking. In real life, he's one of the best offensive linemen to ever play the game, as is shown with his Hall of Fame induction in 2014. In real life, I do have one of his autograph cards, which is really cool. And it's awesome getting to see Walter Jones finally make his way into Madden Mobile. This is definitely long overdue, and I'm very glad that he has the Legends card he deserves. Walter Jones is also the first 91 overall offensive legend for this year, which is saying a lot. He was selected because of his incredible offensive blocking stats 
and this is definitely shown well in his 91 overall offensive tackle legends card and now we come to the 91 overall defensive tackle gilbert brown this is the player out of these two that i will be adding to my team and you will see gameplay of him later today all right gilbert brown is a 91 overall defensive tackle with guaranteed 40 power when you add him to your team he's the legendary number 93 for the green bay packers in real life this guy was an absolute monster on the defensive line and was basically a modern version of me and joe green all right let's flip him over and take a look at the stats for 91 overall legends defensive tackle gilbert brown all right gilbert brown is a power rushing defensive tackle which does tie in with a high strength high power high awareness of this card gilbert brown has 70 speed which is kind of low but just like walter jones offensive and defensive linemen are usually not very high speed due to the fact that they are very power oriented players now there are some exceptions like dwight freeney at 89 speed but the vast majority of defensive and offensive linemen are power based and not speed based all right so following that 70 speed he does have 87 strength which is pretty good slightly lower than walter jones is 90 strength but 87 is still very powerful he has 78 acceleration 91 awareness that's impressive he can easily scan offensive linemen scan quarterbacks scan running backs figure out exactly where everybody's going to go and then make the appropriate moves to get the right tackles and blocks or whatever else needed to stop an offense from progressing he also has 90 tackles so if he goes in for the tackle goes in for the sack he's pulling them to the ground which is a very good metric for a defensive tackle he also has 92 block shed that's important for a defensive tackle defensive lineman that means that he's able to break off of offensive linemen like walter jones aaron donald's out of position card and get in the backfield which is important if you're trying to get sacks tackles in the backfield and other important defensive moves that are going to win you games in madden mobile all right he has 89 power moves which is pretty good 85 finesse moves and then 84 pursuit which are decent stats once again because he's not a speed based player his pursuit's gonna be a little low but he is still able to make chase at least to some degree chase down a running back in the backfield perhaps or within a few yards of the line chase down the quarterback to get a sack so on and so forth let's take a look at his biography brown achieved 292 tackles over 125 yards with the green bay packers and was a super bowl 31 champion now we've seen gilbert brown in madden mobile in the past and he is always an amazing addition to any defense this year is no different so i'm gonna be adding gilbert brown to my team here in a little while and you will see that in a video coming shortly after this one all right so without further ado i think i'm gonna go ahead and cut this video here if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up down below to let me know also if you're new to the channel and you enjoy what you saw please go ahead and subscribe down below we're at 1052 subscribers and growing every single day also if you hit the bell next to the subscription icon you'll get a notification every time a new video uploads on this channel we upload every single weekday and occasionally on the weekends so make sure to hit that bell so you get notified every time i drop a new video for you guys also if you want to join the discord associated with this channel which is called the locker room i will leave a link pinned in the comments down below for you guys to join we have tons of amazing conversations in there we have tons of amazing conversations in the locker room about the game about what's coming on the channel and all kinds of stuff so if you join the locker room you'll be a part of a huge group of fans about 60 people or so that are great fans of the channel great supporters and you'll have the ability to talk to them as well as talk to me directly and if you tag me in the locker room at jeff i'll make sure to contact you directly either via dm or by replying in the chats so like i said i'm going to run through these guys real quick walter jones is a great offensive tackle and if you need help protecting the pass this is exactly who you need to have on your offense and the gilbert brown if you need help on your defensive line if you need pure raw power and strength this is the player to go with i will be getting gilbert brown adding him to my team and there'll be gameplay coming of that very soon so without further ado i'm gonna go ahead and end the video here thank you all so much for watching and as always i will see you in the next madden mobile video